What's good, YouTube? It's your man, BG Tech Life. And as you can see, got a whole stack of cases here, about nine cases for the iPhone 11. Now you say, BG Tech Life, how did you get the iPhone 11? Because I'm special. Say, like, no, this is, this is not the iPhone 11. It's the iPhone 11, and this is what it will look like, but this is actually a dummy. Shout out to Subcase, the folks over at Subcase. They sent us out so we can pre iPhone 11 determine what cases we're going to get for this phone. Because this phone is going to need to be protected. The display is going to need to be protected. And this cat, this, this camera definitely going to need to be protected as big as, as it is on the back. So this is probably the iPhone 11, like the, the mid. This is going to be the regular size. Then you probably going to have a max. It's got a 6.1 inch display on it. But um, like I said, I got a whole bunch of cases here from Subcase, and we just gonna go through them. I'm gonna let y'all see them so y'all already know. Cause I know a lot of y'all that's pre-ordering and getting ready. And you know what I mean? As soon as the event happened, y'all gonna do the pre-order and wait for the phone. So let's take a look at these cases. Okay, boom. Got the Subcase Unicorn Beetle Sport. As you can see, military drop protected, official Subcase sticker. It is perfect grip and scratch resistant, shock resistant, dual layer design, uh, accurate cutouts. Everything you want in the case. Let's check this out. Boom. This is just a dope case right here. Nice gray and tail look. And we got a built-in screen protector on this case, y'all. And um, on these iPhone cases, you're going to see these built-in screen protectors for the simple fact that iPhones are not curved screen uh, devices, so you don't have to worry about that. Just like with your Galaxy, you got to worry about that. With these Galaxy phones, uh, actually case companies, they probably just gave up. And it was best they did because it wasn't working out good. You got to get you like a white stone dome for that. But for this, you can get you, as you can see, I don't know already inserted the case into the two-part case. It's the front with the built-in screen protector. And this is the back. And look, you see cutouts very nice. Uh, sports type look to match your uh, Apple Watch. Got buttons on there, cut out for your mute button, and you got some sub case branding. Just drop the phone into the front of the frame like so. That's dope, that's nice. You know what I mean? If that should look that sportier look, to match your iPhone look, that's it right there. I mean, to match your iWatch, that's it right there. Moving on to the next case. We got the Electro Unicorn Beetle. Military drop protected, official stick on there. Uh, it's perfect grip man, shock resistant, scratch resistant, dual layer design, accurate cutout, and it's gonna be green. So we're gonna pull that up out. You can see normal suck case packaging. You get the thank you and the instructions, but I'm not dealing with no instructions. So the Electro, Oh, that's hot. It's actually a clear case. You got this different type of green going on right here. Um, very nice green, like a dark lime type green for real. And uh, this case has a built-in screen protector also. So you get some dope cases from, let me move these back. So I mean, you get some dope cases from Subcase with built-in screen protectors. And as you can see, it's gonna break the case down like so, two parts. Nice clear back, as you can see, it doesn't change the color of my hands. Nice, uh, this is a very pretty green, like almost like a candy apple green. Looks very good, front to match. You can see, pull all this out. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and drop my iPhone in there. My iPhone dummy, the big dummy. As you can see, like I said, all you have to do, insert it into the front, Got to insert it into the front, take the front, and put it into the back. It's very easy. And once you push it in all the way, I think pretty much lines up. Make sure you got your little grooves lined up so you get the optimal protection, and that's how that's going to look. As you can see, you got some nice subcase branding, nice cutouts that match, nice protection around your camera area. You're going to need that nice raised lip and a nice built-in screen protector because you got that flat screen. Go your buttons, cut out for your mute button, and you got a power button. So that is the Electro, and we're gonna move on to another UB Sport case. And this one is gonna be 
purple. So let's see how this looks. Same type case as the first case. It's just purple, you know, for those that like, and it's got like a pink, purple and pink type deal. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna install the iPhone to this case so y'all can see how it looks. Pretty much the same as the first case, the first sports case, of course, just a different color. I didn't set these up in any particular color guy, I mean, any particular order guys. I'm just trying to let y'all see all of them. So pull the back out and pull the front out. Take this plastic off, they protecting your screen protector. They want your screen protector to stay in order until you get it and throw your device in there. And for y'all that like purple and pink, and you can't just say ladies no more, it's a ladies case or it's a man's case, because you know it's 2019, everybody's doing everything. So boom, there you go. Make sure that's on there right correctly. Nice raised lip on the uh definitely nice raised lip on these uh sport lipping cases, these sport type cases. The UB Sports definitely got a nice little raised lip, built-in front screen protector, so a lot of protection for your screen. That go your subcase branding, goes the back, nice holy case, definitely not waterproof, LOL. And you got a cutout for your mute button, and you got a volume rocker. So, moving on. Moving forward, we got another sport case. We're gonna take this out real quick, so it can be ready to go into this next sport case. Oh, and I didn't even read that one. This is the gray and black. Same as every, all the other sport cases, but it's just gray and black. I'm gonna let y'all see it. Let the camera catch that. That gray is kind of dark. It looks, at, at a quick glance, it looks all black. And as you can see, the, the frame on the front is actually gray. Let's go ahead and start breaking this thing down. At this point, you guys should know what's going on with the case. I'm gonna just let y'all see the phone in the case. I'm gonna let the phone model the case for y'all. And this is nothing but a model phone. It's a dummy. Okay, we're gonna insert it. Push it in. Boom. Like I said, raised lip. Holes on the back, definitely not waterproof, but it's definitely got that look to match your watch or whatever. Definitely scrim tech the built in and a raised lip. Nice black and gray subcase, uh, Brandon. Very nice cutouts. This in these cases, these uh, UB Sport cases feel so soft in the hand, man. They so soft in the hand, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, that's the first thing that I'm noticing about them when I'm pulling them out, actually, that they just really nice and soft in the hand. So, next case, we got the Electro Boom Military Drop Tested and you know, dual air design, aggregate cutout, shot resistant, scratch resistant, whatever, is definitely gonna be in black. And this is the first one we saw was green, guys. So these are some nice cases, man. I'm definitely putting some links in the description for you guys, so you guys can really check these cases out for yourself. Look, that's dope. Now, if you got that, now, I'm not exactly sure what colors app was coming out with, but if you got like a, Space gray iPhone 11. That's that's hot. Or oh, black iPhone 11. This is like a chrome gunmetal type look with the gray frame on the front. This is definitely some heat right here. Like this is definitely giving me ideas. Come on now. For my what I do with my iPhone when I get it, because we probably gonna get the iPhone 11 Max or something like that. And I'm sure they have all these cases in the Max. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw it in the front. It's gonna look dope on this phone, actually. But definitely, you got like a gunmetal gray or something like that. Definitely gonna be some heat. Boom, boom, boom. Inserted, locked in. Got that subcase branding, got those cutouts. Got that power button. Power button very smooth, rocker, uh, volume rocker very smooth. Mute button, cutout, nice. Uh, raised lip action, nice screen protector built in action, and, and the gray goes good with the Apple logo. Very nice, very nice. So, I'm gonna keep it moving. I see we at the 10 minute mark here, almost guys. I gotta bring you all this 
Unicorn, I gotta bring you all this suck case goodness. Okay, so what is this? This is actually the Unicorn Beetle Clear. This is gonna be something. If you wanna just let your phone shine, this is it right here. There's no front screen protect on this. It's just a clear case. It's no screen protect that all built in. Also, it's nice though. It's very nice. I see something that I like already. You know, these clear cases, people just think a clear case can just be an easy, cheap, clear TPU case. No, no, look at that. No. Look at that brand. Look at that subcase branding and that gloss on the clear. And look how clear it is. I like this case. And you got some, you got like a, you know, some ridges on the power button that you know is there. Still plus and, plus and minus on the volume rocker. Cut out for your, uh, nice little cut out for your mute button. There it is. And you still getting a little raised lip action, but you get no screen protection. Here it is, you can barely tell it's on, guys. Guys, still got a nice up case branding. So you definitely, this is definitely a nice clear case right here. You know I got a thing for clear cases. So definitely a nice clear case. All right, now what we have here, we got the Unicorn Beetle in black. UB style, Unicorn Beetle style black. Let's check it out. And this is, this doesn't have a screen protector in it. Not a built-in screen protector. It's a clear case with a uh, black type bumper. I always like a nice little bumper case. As you can see, we got some nice subcase branding on there. I always liked a, just a nice black bumper case. And this would go dope again on a lot of your iPhones because it's about to be dope on this one. And this just a dummy. But I like how the, uh, the outline the bumper actually matches especially the outline for the camera actually matches the uh apple logo you know the small things and that's the iphone it matches this little inner outline the inner outline matches the back of the phone the iphone were in the apple very good get a little bit of raised lip not much on this nice uh nice power button with the ridges that's dope Volume up and down, plus minus on there. Cut out for your mute button. So that's the UB style. You know, this is very nice. Very nice case. Put the links definitely down in the description. Last two guys. So let's see what we got here. We got the uh, Unicorn Beetle Echo, that's in purple. And the Unicorn Beetle Echo, that's in blue. So they're gonna be the same cases. They're gonna both be, you know, like you said, perfect grip, scratch resistant, dual lead design, accurate cutout, shock resistant, military drop tested, and got the official subcase stickers on them. We're gonna go ahead and pull them out both at the same time. Boom, open that one up. Boom, open this one up. Boom. Boom, there we go. So, it's definitely something that we're getting and we definitely getting into it. Let me get all that, that stuff out the way. I don't need no instructions. I can see that we working with uh, built-in screen protectors though. Built-in screen protector. Built-in screen protector. Oh, and they got a nice little, you can check them out. They remind me of just like the, uh, the green case, but these are called the Echo. Um, eco. They look very nice. As you can see the blue and the purple have a very nice uh, finish to them. Very nice shiny finish. Uh, very glossy. Glossy trim around the camera. We're going to check these out. As you can see that suck case branding. Very dope. I'm going to go ahead and ooh. That sounds nasty, didn't it? Sound like a, somebody ripped one. There we go. And I'm going to get this up out of here. First, I'm going to use the, I'm going to display the purple. Boom. Boom. Oh, no, no. I, I see. I messed up. I just didn't follow my own steps. I go into the front of the case first. 
and we slam the front of the case into the back of the case. It's very nice. Got the dark purple gloss with the with the pinkish color. Make sure it's all lined up for y'all. And there it is. Nice clear back. You can show off your iPhone. Got nice subcase branding, cutouts, power button, volume up and down, and your uh, mute button. Definitely a nice case right here. Definitely a eye-catching case. Boom, last case. Now we got the same case in blue. But the greenish, tailish uh, front frame. Go ahead, dump it in there like so. And boom, boom. There we go. Nice subcase branding. Definitely a nice blue gloss to it. Very nice case right here, guys. Very nice. So, it's nine cases from subcase. Let me see. Let me, maybe I can get a thumbnail going on. This might be my thumbnail, guys. Nine cases from subcase. Very nice. Very nice cases. Uh, very uh, affordable. Very economic. Shaman BG Tech Life. Shout out to Subcase for sending out the cases and the dummies. Um, if you like the video, if you like some of the cases, go ahead and like the video. If you not subscribed, go ahead and get subscribed. I'm always bringing this type of content, the newest accessories for the newest devices. Shaman BG Tech Life. If you're not following me on Twitter, go ahead and follow me on Twitter and get inspired. BG underscore tech life over on twitter bg tech life on instagram it's your man bg i'm out peace